Appalachian Wireless has some of the best data rates in wireless on our plans, and not to mention an amazing deal on one of our hottest smartphones. But that's all the time I have to explain. See store for details. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. After numerous delays, James Huffman IV was finally set to stand trial beginning today in the New Year's Day 2014 stabbing death of Michael Hogg. But it wasn't to be. In Letcher Circuit Court, the special judge in the case, Kent Hendrickson, ordered another continuance, citing a situation involving two of the witnesses in the case. There was an incident over the weekend that uh, I'm not going to go into details that, uh, uh, that the family affected two witnesses. Um, and uh, one prosecution witness and one defense witness. And uh, it, it, it is, uh, it's such that we're going to have to have a continuance. We can't move on at this point. Now this has been a case in which a lot of people in Letcher County have taken particular interest and that's also been a big concern to the defense in the case. At several times throughout the proceedings, the defense has expressed a concern about finding an impartial jury here in Letcher County. Now today's news about the trial being continued actually came as the jury pool was in the courtroom, presumably to be selected for the trial. Hendrickson thanked the jurors for being present, but he said he had no choice but to order the continuance and declined to give any details about the situation involving the witnesses. The circumstances uh, of what happened over the weekend may going forward uh, uh, all but impossible. And I think that the only human humane thing to do in, in this situation is to continue this until a later date. Hendrickson said he plans to have a phone conference with the attorneys from both sides at a later date. Neither side spoke during today's hearing, and no date for when the trial will go forward was discussed. In Whitesburg, Chris Anderson, EKB News.